So normally I make videos for new Blender users, but for all the people who are out there being creators, um, I thought this would help. So I have Blender 3.2 and I have been trying to get the screencast keys to work for 3.2 and I've been getting an error. So the first time I tried to do this, um, all I did was I went here, I read what they said about release page, clicked on the release page, I see that the latest version is 3.7. Then to actually get 3.7, I go to where it wants me to go. Where is that? It is, did I pass it already? Um, screencastkeys.zip, right? I click on that. I download it, I already downloaded it once. Uh, I open up Blender. Blender, I'm using version 3.2. I do edit and I do preferences. And then from edit preferences, I click install, which I'm sure all of this stuff you already did. Uh, software for me, sorry, that was not correct. I'm trying to be quick because I know how I hate when people drone on about. This. So I look for the main, the usual uh, screencast keys zip here. I click install. And then there it is there. And I get this error, right? So this is the issue I was having. Apparently it works for version 3.1, but not 3.2. So in order to fix that, you are going to go to that same website. And uh, honestly, after I tell you the, this part, you can probably stop the video, but I'll go through the whole process. So 3.7 doesn't work. It turns out just with a little bit of searching, you need version 3.8. And how do you get version 3.8 you say? Well, if you go back here uh, and look for the unstable version, it's this screencast keys master zip here. Um, and uh, they have manual instructions for how to download it. So if you do this, you can download it. Uh, let me show you the correct place to look at this. No, see, I should have been more prepared. I was trying to just make a quick video here. But, uh, the document if you have trouble and stuff add on right so this has the list here and you can see 3.7 is the latest stable version uh the latest unstable version which i'm assuming will be version 3.8 and then they have manual instructions here for how to actually download and install it so we're going to do that really quick i click download it's called screen key master.zip i already have that downloaded you have to actually extract it and do it manually so for me if i open up where it is so i downloaded it and it was called screencast keys masters i had to extract it into this screencast keys master folder here and then in the directions it tells you where in the folder the folder you want is so in source screencast keys so i look it into the screencast keys I see here I go into source and there's a folder here called screen cast keys. That's a lot of times I can say screen cast keys. So you want to copy this in the proper folder and to know what your proper folder is right here. They have a really easy to follow a uh, place where all the different folders are. So for me, I went to this location here and you can see I have these add-ons here and this is the old one that I just installed that doesn't work so I'm going to go ahead and delete that I could have deleted it from inside of Blender um, but I'm just going to go I'm just going to delete it here to make things quick and then I had the folder that I downloaded I'm just going to control C move that out of the way then control V to paste it so now it's here now if I I'm going to go ahead and close Blender and might not need to do that, but just in case, I'm gonna do that because I don't wanna mess things up or waste your time. So then after you open up Blender, you can go to File or Edit, Preferences, then you're gonna type the screen. You see screencast keys here, click it. Oh, and it looks much different, right? So now when I close that, I hit the side panel here. I have screencast keys. And now you can see that it actually 
So that's how you fix that issue. If you have vendor 3.2 and you want to have screencast keys, you're gonna need to get go to the unstable version and use that. Uh, I just did it. I haven't had any problems with it. I haven't really tested it fully, but that'll allow you to get up and running. Good luck.